I've noticed in several of your postings that you've made the point that courses are somewhat overused as an intervention. So what's wrong with a course? What's wrong with a course? That's a big question. I'll try to keep my answer short. One thing that's wrong with a course is that often it just shouldn't be developed. We think a course is a solution when it's actually not the best solution. And I blame that on the learning management system. If you have a hammer, everything starts looking like a nail. If you have an LMS, every solution starts looking like it should be a course. Even when a better solution might be an online reference, a workshop, or even an email. What's another problem? When we create a course, we turn into control freaks. We forget that our learners are smart. We lead them by the nose. We tell them everything we think they should know and everything that we think they should do. And we don't, we don't trust them to draw any conclusions on their own. We confuse instructional design with programming people. What's another problem? We put too much information in. Often there's information in a course that just doesn't really need to be given to the learners at all. And then there's other information that is useful, but useful on the job, and therefore more useful in an external reference, like an online reference, rather than locked away in the LMS. I could go on, but let me propose one solution. What I've been fond of doing lately is using tools like wikis or blogs that make it very easy to toss up a website. So you use the wiki or blog to create a simple content management system, basically, without having to know any HTML. And then for the content that really benefits from being interactive, you use your Flash development tools, your rapid e-learning development tools to create a little compact interactive for just that content, which you embed in the other content on your HTML site. This is very quick to put up, very easy to update. You still have a menu if you want. You still even can have the next button if you want. But it, it's just a very flexible, quick, agile way to create e-learning, in my opinion. It's what I've been doing.